The federal government has ordered two companies linked to a deadly bus crash in Texas last week to stop operating. 17 people died and several others are in critical condition following Friday's rollover crash. The order was issued Sunday to Angel Tours Incorporated, Iguala Bus Max Incorporated and their officers. A second order was issued to Angel De La Torre. He's the president and owner of both companies. The government says the carrier poses an imminent hazard to the public. The unlicensed bus smashed into a guardrail and skidded off a highway early Friday near the Texas-Oklahoma state line. I felt that my leg was, uh, somebody lay on my legs. And then right next to me, there was a lady. She got her arm really crushed up. Federal records show the bus had not been approved for operation. The bus operator had sought federal certification for the vehicle in June, just weeks after it filed incorporation papers with the state of Texas. The bus was carrying 55 people from Houston to Missouri for a religious festival. Matt Friedman, the Associated Press.